All right, today we've got the holster for the uh, Taurus GX4. I want to show you a few things about the um, GX4 and the holster and our manufacturing process a little bit. Um, so uh, basically to keep some of the costs down, we haven't really invested in a lot of uh, like printing because uh, we can order these bags that are printed up and all that good stuff. Um, but it costs a lot of money, so we just use the bags, we buy bags, and we just write what they are on them at this point in time. Uh, we're a small mom and pop, uh, so this cuts down on a lot of our costs so we can keep our uh, holster prices uh, fairly low. Uh, you know, materials and stuff have went up and all that stuff, so we can't go too low. Um, especially we are more of a custom uh, mom and pop. However, we do have stock items, and the GX4 is... Uh, one of those stock items so uh, I'm gonna link some videos below that goes over a lot about our holsters uh, it shows you uh, about some of the hardware it shows you uh, about this here uh, the mounting uh, it is both left and right handed is ambidextrous uh, it is also uh, inside or outside the waistband it comes with two belt clips all of them come with two belt clips because uh, outside the waistband you're absolutely going to want the two belt clips Inside the waistband, I highly suggest using both belt clips because when you put it on your uh, body, uh, you want it to sit where you put it uh, the entire time. So when you're practicing, it's your guns in one spot because you're just standing, but when you're sitting and getting up, and uh, whatever you're doing throughout the day, whether you're an office job or construction worker, uh, and you're moving, you don't want this gun uh, to move around and be down in your belt, stuff like that. So even for your inside the waistband guys, I highly suggest uh, mounting it with both uh, belt clips they are adjustable up and down um, so you can go both up you can uh, lower your ride put your ride a little bit higher or you can cant your ride of your gun um, and there's a video I'm gonna link down below about that uh, there's also a video down below I'm gonna link about how the retention you got three uh, screws you got two here one there that uh, works on the retention or the tightness of the gun in the holster. Uh, there's a video below that goes over that and that same video goes over this belt wing. Uh, the belt wing is uh, for both basically in the waistband you may uh, put either the small or the large riser. It comes with both of those. Uh, outside the waistband you'll probably just take the riser off altogether uh, and then have that for uh, holster stability basically uh, which is a really good feature of this holster. Uh, so in that video it goes over the uh, retention and the uh, belt wing. Uh, also there will be a video below that shows you how to take all this hardware off, put it over here. It is both um, uh, ambidextrous for inside or outside the waistband so you can have it either way. Uh, left or right handed inside, left or right handed outside the waistband. And there's other features and I'll link a longer video below that goes over all those features. Alright, so what our guns are looking for, or with our holsters, uh, is the audible snap. And yes, I've already cleared this firearm. Uh, so this is an actual uh, Taurus GX4. This is one of my personal guns. Uh, and we're going to insert it. So we've got that audible snap. It just doesn't fall out. And then I can grab and pull the gun out. Uh, now, for the industry standard, how do we check most of our holsters? We use a blue gun. This blue gun is an exact replica. If we can see this, it is the exact same gun. Uh, these guys have been manufacturing these. It's uh, Rings Blue Guns. They've been manufacturing these for a long, long time. Uh, and they've gotten really, really good uh, at, at coming to the exact replica. I mean, everything is the exact. Uh, so what we do is we make it off our molds. And then we take our blue gun, snaps in, pulls out, snaps in, pulls out. This has got a good uh, outside the waistband pull right now. If I was inside the waistband, I might loosen it up a little bit more um, because that belt's going to help tighten it to you as well. Uh, so I might, uh, but this has got a good snap pull on it. Uh, outside the waistband, that would be what I would want. Uh, inside the waistband, loosen it a little more, uh, and then that belt to help tighten it back down. Uh, and then you've still got that good uh, pull on it. It's not just going to fall out if you get an altercation or something. Your gun's just not going to go sliding across the floor. Uh, and you don't want that. It'll still have the audible click. You know it's snapped in. Uh, that way it doesn't go flying out. Um, all right, guys. This is for the uh, Taurus GX4 uh, holster that we make. And you can find it at defensetraining.org backslash holster.